Hello everyone and welcome back to the Irish Buddha Gaming Channel. My name is Irish Buddha, or Scott if you're feeling fancy. Uh, today, uh, I want to show you guys what I've done since uh, we last spoke. Um, I, you remember we did the bamboo farm. Uh, we got that set up and ready to go. We, uh, While I was in... Uh, Doing that, a Enderman uh, showed up and put a block in the middle of this one, and as it's from right there, uh, and all of my dudes here got out. Uh, so I had to corral them back up and put them uh, back in here. I had to um, uh, kill a bunch of them because they just would not come in. So I think about half of them, uh, about five or six of them got uh, killed. You know, it is what it is, um, but what can you do? Uh, so what I did, uh, I went, I got bored, uh, and I didn't want to drag you guys along for the boring thing in case I didn't see anything. I went that way, uh, which is south um and i'm about to show you what i found but uh yeah i made an extension of the nether uh highway that way because it connected to a um a village and also uh okay here's the everything that went down uh i spent about six to eight hours playing uh on on this world the other day because uh, or over the weekend because what happened was I wanted to go ahead and get the fortress out of the way uh, to find where the ender portal was and everything and to do that I had to go into the end and do a bunch of trading with uh, some of my uh, the piglins uh, hoglins piglins uh, I got a bunch of uh, Eyes of Ender. I got eight of them, uh, but I've, I've had that one for a while uh, from one that I killed in here. But um, I also had to, it took me forever to get the ones that I got uh, because they said that the uh, portals for the end they spawn with either six to nine empty spots. Um, so I went ahead and got seven made up. I, I need to go back into the end and get two more blaze rods so I can do um, another one. Uh, or to get the other two ender pearls uh, turned into eyes of ender. Well, um, while I was doing that, I had a bunch of... Uh, um, I had about 15 total, I think, and I used, uh, what was it, eight, eight of them, whatever, however many it was, uh, at, that's what I've got left over after finding, uh, the fortress. So let me go ahead and take you guys over there. That's why I'm getting the rotten flesh, because you'll see why here in a second. Uh, so go in here. Get my sword up. Okay, and it's literally just a straight shot here. Because uh, I put the portal uh, in the, the new village. Uh, so we should be able to go out and get into a... Um, bed to make it daytime because it, it was getting dark there. So... When I did this, you can hear the gas everywhere. <laughs> um, Got to go up here real quick. We're in the middle of a basalt biome. Uh, it's just ugh, horrible. But, you know, you can't guarantee where your portal is going to be in the end when you go through it in the overworld. So <laughs> you don't know what level it's going to be on. Uh, I'm sure there's a way to figure it out, but I just have no idea. But here we are. There's 
the town. Let me go ahead and sleep real quick. There are a butt load of villagers here. Uh, none of them, but maybe two, have jobs. Uh, I know one of them's the cleric, which we're going to use here. And the other, uh, the other one might be a. Uh, Uh, there's the cleric. Stop running. Let's get some uh, stuff from you. Okay, well, we got you uh, locked in. Uh, there might be two clerics here then, uh, but I think the other one is... I thought it was a... Uh, farmer but there's no farms here so it could be whatever this guy is and I could just be way off uh, yeah I'm way off that there was just one apparently so the uh, the cleric is the only one which is fine you know he's the only one we need anyway definitely don't need the nitwit but you know what can you do but I've already got a brewing stand, so I don't need to take that one. But I've already looked around. There's nothing in this village. Um, so I'm not worried about, you know, getting anything here. Uh, hey. <clears throat> All right. So what I did, um, this is... Took me about a day and a half to get over this way, uh, just to find this. We are now at 136, 74, 14, 21, and our uh, regular coordinates, you know, they're uh, not too far off. <laughs> uh, so we're, we're doing good. Uh, we've never been this way before. Uh, so... That's why I was like, I'm just going to check it out because we've been uh, on several adventures and they've been a bust. Um, but I want to show you guys, uh, I cleared out a big section here and used that to do the uh, the dirt bridge here. Uh, I got cobblestone and everything to make sure I was good. Um, this stronghold, it went uh pretty much all the way to uh bedrock uh for where the ender portal is and the reason i wanted to show you guys because it is so weird there wasn't a silverfish spawner uh there wasn't anything uh cool or anything like that that uh um uh, as you can see, I blocked off everything that I wasn't going to need. Uh, real quick, let me go ahead and get three, four, five, six, seven. Um, okay, so come on. I mean, it just it it just spawns so weird in here. I don't know what the deal was. I've had a couple of areas where uh, I've got the stronghold, but I didn't get the end portals. Uh, like, see that one right there? Look at that. <laughs> it spawned like inside there, but I need one, two, three, four, five. So I've got plenty of ender eyes. Um, yeah, so that's good. It's just. I don't know what is going on with this world. I've had nothing but bad luck after bad luck with this one. Uh, but, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what is going on. Um, we're most likely going to save off the going through the portal until probably episode 50 maybe. So 17 more episodes, 16 more episodes. I haven't decided yet. Uh, just because I'm not sure when I'm going to go through. Because uh, I want to be able to go fight the Ender Dragon. 
and have it be fun. You know, I don't want it to be just a uh, slaughter fest of him killing me over and over and over again. But uh, when I do go, uh, you know, I just want you to know, of course, I'm going to record and everything for it. So, um, but I wanted to show everybody, uh, you know, I found it. I got uh, lucky that it wasn't like super far away. But, um, I thought I saw something down there. Uh, actually, let's go kill these squid real quick because, you know, they're here in a river. So let's just go ahead and block it off. That way. That's good enough. Yeah. Awesome. Three. Cause I, every bit of ink helps, especially with the the way my stupid uh Well, shoot. <laughs> I guess I they're dumb, so <laughs> Alright, so, uh, with how everything's going with the sheep over there, uh, every bit of dye helps. I guess I can just put all that back <laughs> somewhere, huh? But anyway, uh, so... I spent just eight hours wandering, playing around, uh, trading with piglins and getting ender pearls and fighting blazes and everything. And it was just a very tedious thing. Um, and so that, you know, I just didn't want you guys to have to sit through all that. But uh, what I did was was come you know, like I said I came across this village awesome uh of course like every other village I've came across it's a crap village <laughs> so let's go ahead and go back through here real quick go back to the house now the good news is uh with everything being the way it is uh I should be able to widen this because this is pretty much a straight shot back to the house. Uh, with the exception of those steps, which I can take a boat down. Uh, I'll just need to widen this. Uh, no, gotta get out of there. <laughs> All I need to do is just widen this over another one. And I should be able to get uh, some villagers back to the house. Which is going to be great, because at least that way I won't have to uh, waste my time breeding them. Uh, when I can just get them for free, you know, so that helps. Uh, let's get back through here real quick. And I am trying to, my cocoa's going pretty good. Uh, upgraded, not upgraded. I made a double fence, uh, because I was still getting stuff being able to get in. I don't know how they were. Um, so I went ahead and lit up everything as well. And when I was going through the, the nether, I got, in, uh, some more glowstone and I got the, this fixed up, uh, now. So yeah, it, it's now just glowstone, uh, not as grand now. So I might have to, uh, get rid of it, but you know, we'll, we'll see. Um, my bamboo farm's not doing horrible. Uh, it's not doing fantastic, but it's not doing horrible either. Uh, I think I'm just in a bad uh, spot here. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, once this gets filled up all the way, I will start using it as fuel. Uh, so... That's the plan for this, anyway. Um, all these 
are great still. See how my chicken farm's doing. Oh, I was about to say, holy crap. <laughs> no, I did that. <laughs> how many feathers do I got? Just sit oh well. Wow. There's a lot of feathers sitting in there, huh? Let's uh keep this bottom row for feathers. Yeah, there we go. Uh, that's not it's not horrible, considering all things considered. Uh, shut that back. Um, where did I have it? So uh, the reason I wanted to also show you this is because I want to show you my new world that I've got. Um, that uh, it's an amazing world right now. Um, let me get these taken care of real quick. And where was I putting it? Let me put that there. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this real quick, uh, show you how uh, everything has been working out for uh, for us. <laughs> uh, it's not anything fancy or nothing, uh, but it's not anything uh, crazy. So let me go ahead and sleep real quick. So I spent a long time running around and everything uh, doing all this uh, so let me go ahead and show you guys the other or uh, my new one <laughs> uh, this one I got so lucky on uh, I pretty much spawned in a village uh, I was literally just right down this way uh, let me show you guys real quick uh, okay right up here is where I spawned at uh, like right there I believe yeah some somewhere on that little area so I just went this way I was like you know well, this is ways north or west wow I went this way and that way I think because I was like I couldn't see through the trees or nothing I got up on a little berm up here a little area like right in here I think yeah, got it uh, it was a little hill over here that I got up on and I was able to see smoke from a village like oh, oh, there's a uh, there was smoke coming up there there it is see it right there uh, and I was like oh there's a village there so <laughs> so I went over there uh, it's a great uh, village. It had a uh, oh, stupid Enderman. As you can see, also I've got fence around uh, the area I'm using. Anyway, not the full village. Uh, this guy was actually over here at first. Uh, there was a little area right here that had two armor stands that I put in here. Uh, and he had his grindstone over there with a uh, blast furnace. And he is able to give me unbreaking two and sharpness two. There is another guy over here. This is where I got my farms and stuff set up. Um, 
I got a another weapon guy up here. Uh, that uh, these two were. One was a farmer that got stuck in there, so I kept him. The other guy I turned into uh, the weapons smith because uh, I didn't want just the guy I had. He's a sharpness to uh, sword with unbreaking two X. Uh, they had much better deals, but when I maxed them out, uh, I haven't had to use them as often. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, but we've got an iron golem roaming around here somewhere. Uh, there he is. But all the other villagers are pretty much gone right now. Uh, there, there's nothing really for them in the village anymore. <laughs> uh, so they, they've all left or died. Uh, but the here's why this was such a great uh, vill or great spawn for me. Um, down here anyway, all of these uh, weapons, but two of the swords and these two axes. Uh, so one, two, three, four. Uh, four of these worth. Uh, probably five because I think I broke one. Uh, plus these diamonds. Uh, a bunch of iron that I, I've also used to trade with or uh, turn into emeralds. But I'm, I'm digressing. Uh, but all of that was I've been able to find down in my mine, which has been amazing mine as well. Uh, but here is the reason why this is such a great spawn for uh, or a great world. Uh, like I was out adventuring, as I am wont to do. <laughs> uh, I was over this way. I was actually trying to find cows uh, to bring back, and I wasn't. I hadn't found any at the, at that time, uh, but there is a was a thing down here, right there, as you can see, almost at uh, ground level, is a spawner, a not a spider spawner, a skeleton spawner. So I turned it into an XP grinder, um, which has been working amazing, as you can see. Um, you saw the chest that I have up at the base that has uh, bone meal in it, uh, which I need to take some arrows because I don't need to save this many up. Uh, as you can see, I've got two chests here, and just a bunch. I mean, I've, I've already went through so many enchantments. Uh, as you can see on my pickaxes and stuff, and uh, sharpness one, uh, I did those. I merged two weapons here. I got sweeping edge and sharpness two, and then I had an unbreaking two, um, that I merged those together, but, yeah, I mean, it's, it's like non-stop, this thing just pumps out the XP, uh, which is amazing, and like I said, it is pretty much right on the surface, so, uh, which has been great, so I've been using that, of course, uh, to get levels and stuff, and, like I showed you for my bone mill or my hmm, uh, let's see for my farms I've got the if I need to use them I've got a chest of that much bone mill ready to go uh, of course I've got the uh, this one out here I've got some bone mill in um, or I did uh, before I moved it, but here's my, you know, I've got beets over in this area, 
between wheat here and then of course my sugar cane and just regular regular weird farms here but uh this is uh, if things keep going as badly as they are <laughs> Uh, on the other world, I might have to change worlds, uh, just because this one was amazing. Uh, I don't want to change worlds because I put a lot of work into the other one. Uh, but yeah, it's just been insane. Um, let me put all these arrows in here. But I've got, you know, just great enchantments and everything, and it's just been so cool. So I just wanted uh, to show everybody everything that's been going on in the new world and stuff. When when I'm not playing my regular world making videos for you guys, this is where I'm at. So um, with that being said, uh, we are going to be looking into what all we need to get to go to the nether and fight the ender dragon. Because I really wanted the elytra and some... Uh, shulker chest and stuff like that which we will uh get soon so uh yeah that's what we're going to do for next episode and everything and you know we'll see what we can do then so uh hope everybody had a wonderful time watching uh if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe uh if you would like to leave a comment that would be fantastic too if not completely understand. I hope everybody has a wonderful, wonderful day, and I will talk to you next time. Bye, everybody.